find the inverse of the following function. The following f of x is equal to 3x minus 4 over x plus 1. f of x is equal to cube root of x minus 4 over x plus 1. So we need to find the inverse of the following functions. Dear, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment this channel. Now let us start from questions A. Find the inverse of the following function A f of x is equal to 3x minus 4 over x plus 1. Dear, to find the inverse of n functions, which is given, uh, written in the form of this, we need to follow the following steps. The first step is, we need to write, or we need to write y as f of x. Then, uh, the other step is, we need to interchange x by y, solve for y, and write y as f inverse of x. So using that procedures, question number A becomes write y as f of x and y is equal to 3x minus 4 over x plus 1. Then interchange x by y. That means write x as y. So we have x is equal to 3y minus 4 over y plus 1. Multiply both sides by y plus 1. That means to solve for y. Therefore, to solve for y, both sides multiplying both sides by y plus 1 or by crossing this, we have x times y plus 1 is equal to 3y minus 4. Then multiply here y plus 1 by x, we have x times y plus x is equal to 3y minus 4. Then write like term in one side and the other another side so we have x y minus 3 y is equals to minus x minus 4 and here we have or take y as a common we have y into x minus 3 is equal to minus x minus 4 since our aim is to find the values of y so we should have to divide both sides by x minus 3 then y is equal to uh, minus x minus 4 over x minus 3. And as I told you, that's finally we, we say y as f inverse at x, then write y as f inverse at x, and y f inverse at x is equal to minus x minus 4 over x minus 3. Therefore, this, this is the inverse of the functions f of x is equal to 3x minus 4 over x plus 1. Dear all, to check whether this is correct or not, we should have to uh, change that or we should have to check that f of f inverse at x is equal to x, which is the same as f inverse of f of x is equal to x. Question number B. f of x is equal to q root of x minus 4 over x plus 1. So in similar procedures, first we should have write f of x as y, then we have y is equal to q root of x minus 4 over x plus 1. Then by interchanging x by y, we have x is equal to q root of y minus 4 over y plus 1. Then both sides by writing all as power of q q, or since y minus q root of y is the power of 4 over y plus 1 is the same as y minus 4 over y plus 1, the whole is the power of 1 over 3. So to remove this q root, we should have to uh, multiply both sides by q q q q. Therefore, this becomes x that we need to solve for y, then this becomes x cubed is equal to y minus 4 over y plus 1. Then by crisscrossing or by multiplying both sides by y plus 1, we have x cubed into y plus 1 is equal to y minus 4. Then multiply this. Then when we multiply this, we have that x cubed times y plus x is equal to y minus 4. 
then take the like term in one side and the others in the other side. So this is the same as xqy minus y as equals to minus 6 minus 4. And then here we have a common y. So by taking here a common y, then we have y into x cube minus y as equals to minus x cube minus 4. Then since our aim is to solve y, so uh, y becomes minus x cube minus 4 is all over x cube minus 1. Since this is we have a common y, then y into x cube minus 1. Is equal to minus x cubed minus 4, so therefore by dividing both sides by x cubed minus 1, we have y is equal to minus x cubed minus 4 over x cubed minus 1. Then say this y as f inverse of x. So we have f inverse of x is equal to minus x cubed minus 4 over x cubed over minus 1. So that our f inverse x is given like this. f inverse x is equal to minus x to the power of 3 minus 4 over x cube minus 1 is the inverse of f. So to check whether this is correct or not, we should have to check that f of f inverse x is equal with x or f inverse of f of x is equal to x. Thanks for watching my video